people? This is your boy Christian, and this is the Edge, and I am coming to you live right now. I'm looking at um, looking on my phone, but I'm getting ready to do the review for RuPaul's Drag Race with the Elite Five, Five, Five. Bye, 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 bye. Anyway, Elite Five of RuPaul's Drag Race. It was a great show. Yes, it was. And this is what it was all about. The girls had to dress up their mothers. And I know I've been going for a while, so we missed three weeks. So, yeah, we lost Sonique. We've lost Morgan. We lost Sahara. And we've lost Jessica Wilde. Um, so, we're up to date now. I mean, all the people that we lost, we lost them because they just, just you know. Rah! Anyway, oh y'all, y'all know about this. You know you do like this. Those house kids know about that, honey. Um, and then you swam. But anyway, <laughs> um, RuPaul's Drag Race. So the girls had to dress up these old men. These old men happen to be their house mothers or their drag mothers, or the case may be. Um, and. It was all right. It wasn't a good show. It wasn't a bad show. But I have to admit that my standout girl this week was Tyra Sanchez once again. Now, if I have to make a prediction, because of course, if this is the top five, 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 five if this is the top five, um, then of course we lost somebody, and there's gonna be a top four, and the top three, and the top two. So my top, uh, well, the top three automatically you find out who wins in two weeks. So my top three. And my prediction will be Juju B, Raven, and Tyra. Now, Tatiana might make it into the, you know, the, the top three, but I I don't see it. I really don't see it. Um, that means either Raven or Juju B will be going home. Because I don't see Tyra going home. And in all honesty, I think Tyra probably won the show. Once again, that's my prediction. Tyra Sanchez is the winner of RuPaul's Drag Race. But that's my prediction. It hasn't happened yet. We don't know. But when it happens, we'll be there and I'll tell you all about it. Anyway. So, Pandora had a really nasty um, drag mother with um, a, a bathing suit on, a bikini and all this stuff. And it was just, it was just gross. I, I, and she pulled a dildo out of her pants. That was just nasty. Um, who else? Um, Raven um, Drag mother was hairy and skinny and wrinkly and had 11 piercings in his nipple. Now, when we when they showed the behind the scenes, the RuPaul Drag Race Untucked, when they showed that part, it was pretty much a safety pin and a bunch of rings and medallions and dangles and blah 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 blah. blah, blah. Um, it was horrible. I could, it was just nasty. I mean, nasty. But that's neither here nor there. Um, Juju B had a fat mother who thinks that she can do this on a regular basis and she said she's going to get a bunch of, you know, cute guys to sit in chairs and, you know, and be all up over her and just love her and all that stuff. And it's not going to happen any because in real reality, um, I love Juju B, but her makeup sometimes can be a little cakey. Um, and the makeup that she had for her drag mother was a little cakey. And because it was cakey, um, I don't think that it would... It, it didn't really come off realistic. And the short hair just, just, just didn't go quite well. I, I love Raven's mother performance, but Raven's mother was like, you know, like... And his lip sync was like this. He could have been a fish, you know. I mean, he didn't really say... I mean, it was... Um, I enjoyed Tower's mother. They did a little dance. They was, you know, the little sachet queens. It was, you know, cha 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 cha. Um, it was good. I I enjoyed it. I really really did. Um, who else had a good mother? Um, I thought Tatiana mother would be good because she was the one that got a chance to pick the mothers, but she wasn't. Her mother was kind of horrible, and I felt bad for Pandora since, um. Tatiana made this really ugly dress, and then they loved it, and they hate Pandora stuff. Mind you, Pandora was eliminated this weekend. Her lip sync, honey, was horrible. But Juju B, of course, was in the bottom two along with her because her drag mother was horrible mess as well. But Juju B's lip sync, which is always over the top and out of here, off, you know, over the top and out of this world, was good. I enjoyed it. I I enjoyed it the most, and I enjoyed Juju B. So. 
With that being said, um, since Pandora had to leave, oh well, we're down to the top four. And that is Tatiana, Tyra Sanchez, Raven, and Jujube. Now, I always want to know why we don't know who Juju is. Juju B last name is. What's Raven's last name? What's Tatiana's last name? We know Tyra's last name. It's Sanchez. If y'all know anything about the Sanchez, they're legendary, honey. They're legendary. And I'm proud to be a cousin or a relative of any of the Sanchez's. Um, although in the beginning, I hated Tyra. But I love her now because Tyra let me know that she is a diva, honey. She is a diva. She is capital D-I-B-A. Whatever. Um, so anyway. Next week, I'll be doing another review, and I want to say shout-outs to MJ Keaton for hitting me up, saying that you missed the show, you enjoy the Drag Race reviews, and that you want me to do more. So for that, I will be doing more just for you. So thanks, baby. Um, so stay tuned for next week, RuPaul's Drag Race review, um, to see who's going home, what happened, and what I thought of it, because this week was kind of nasty. Kinda, ugh, ugh. These old men just didn't go with well me at all. Uh, if anybody wants to know what I thought of the live lip syncs, I thought everybody was horrible. I really didn't like nobody, and especially Tyra Sanchez. Now, I like Tyra, but unfortunately, Tyra cannot do no lip sync live. Although, she thinks she's Beyonce, and you're not. And we're going to move on. All right, so, everybody, thanks for tuning in, watching the show. Stay tuned for more. I, I'm going to be doing a video later. I'm not going to tell you what it is because I, I don't know when it's coming out. But just stay tuned for it, all right? Peace. Peace.